This video is meant for the educational purpose. Please ensure you understand the step before using any script. The goal is to help you to learn how to complete the lab effectively while following the quick lab turns and services and YouTube community guidelines. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and I hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. In this video, I am going to guide you through the process to complete this lab and help you to understand each step. First, login with your quick lab credentials and once done with that, in the description box of this video, I have shared the GitHub link which will help you to automate some tasks over here. However, I will recommend you to follow along and understand what each command does so you can learn the process effectively. I will encourage to open and review the script to understand each step. So first of all, just me scroll down over here and from here just me open this link in incognito window over here. This will activate your cloud shell. So just me wait for that. And it's finally done. Now just me come back over here and from here you can see this curl command. So just me copy this command. This will download my GitHub repo from my GitHub to your cloud shell. So just me copy this come back and paste over here like this way now we have to make this file executable for that just simply copy this chmod command copy this come back paste hit enter okay now we have to just simply run this file for that we have to just simply copy this command over here so just simply copy this come back paste hit enter now just simply wait now here you can see it's asking for the region for that come back to the lab instructions and here just simply search for the region over here like this way and from here you can see this region so just simply copy this come back paste hit enter wait for a second and then just simply click on authorize now you have to just simply wait for this command get execute and once it's done then you are done with the 90 percent of the lab we have to perform one task manually i will let you know how to do that so just simply wait for this command get execute once you run this script, it will automate many of your steps to required to complete the lab. But it's essential to understand the process behind those steps. The goal is to use this script as a learning tool to help you to complete the lab, not just get a score. After the script run, you can go to the lab page and click on the check my progress to see the score. Make sure to review what each task does and why it's important in the lab so that you are not just getting a score but actually learning the concept. Now just simply wait and watch the command execution and understand what each command is doing.
and is finally done now here you can see both this link so just me open both the links in new tab like this way okay now just me come back to this tab just me wait okay from here just me choose the internal and then click on this create button over here now for the app name come back over here scroll down a little bit and from here you can see this application name so just me copy this name over here like this way come back and paste over here like this okay now just me click over here from here just me choose this user id then again come back over here copy this id scroll down and from here you can see email address just me paste over here like this way click on the save button just simply wait scroll down and click on this save and continue okay now just me click on this back to dashboard and it's done okay now you can just me close this tab okay now if you're asking for the project id you can just me click over here then click on this enable api over here like this okay then click on this go to identity then click on the checkbox over here make sure that you have to click on the checkbox for app engine app okay then click on this toggle and turn it on like this way and it's done okay now just me click on this add principle over here and make sure that the checkbox is checked okay now for the new principle just me copy this username and paste over here like this way now for the role just me scroll down over here and from here you can see this role so just me copy this role over here like this come back and paste over here like this way click over here and then click on the save button just me wait and it's done now if you just come back to the lab instructions and click on the check my progress for each and every task you will get a score without any issue and if the score is not updated for any particular task no need to worry wait for a couple of minutes and you will get a full score on this lab without any issue and as you can see it's updated and that's a way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys Remember, this video is for educational purpose. Please make sure you understand the step and follow the quick lab terms and services and YouTube community guidelines.